election day, and we all hope you have already voted yes. or you're heading to the polls. Yes. Please, okay? Mm -hmm. But Avery, yes. I know that you've been working to make sure that Hispanics get out the vote yes. and make sure that their voices are heard. I want to hear about yeah, it. This is really, really important to me, and I'm really passionate about this. I got the honor uh, to be a part of something called Habla y Vota, which is on HBO Latino, and it pretty much um, allows you to hear different people's stories of, um, you know, immigration, how they got here, why they're inspired to vote. People like Prince Royce, yeah. who we all love, uh, George Lopez, and myself. And um, it's just so important, you guys. I don't think, as Latinos, we recognize our worth and our value in this country, and that uh, we do have a big voice. And when I say big voice, I'm talking 27.3 million wow. eligible Latinos that can vote in this election. And I really, really just want to stress to you guys, we can be the difference. We can make a change with our voice. So please, Latinos, get out there. We're, you know, we get out there and we're heard and everything else. We want to be heard during this election. And um, also, you guys, according to Phone to Action, you guys, there's been a huge spike in Hispanic voter registration due to new texting methods. So get out there and find out about that. And also, Hispanics are expected to make up. You guys, just think about this. One in every 10 voters is Latinos nationally. Yeah. Wow. That's, a, that's a lot of people. Yeah. Yeah. Lot of people. Yeah. We are here. We are. <laughs> you know, the early vote, a lot of the us. Hispanics have gone out. Yes. You yes. know, I'm with so the proud early of you guys. Thank, thank, thank you guys. Doing it. So, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, you guys, if you're sitting at home today uh, because you're just not sure if you're registered or not, we want you to know that it's not too late. Don't count yourself out just because you think you missed the deadline or because you think something got lost in the mail. It's happened, people. So to check your eligibility, visit canivote.org. That's canivote.org, and you guys can actually find out how and where you can locally vote to make your voice be heard. Yes. Make sure you get out there, guys, any way you can. Well, I voted early already. I know. I, yeah. I saw oh, your Instagram. You were the one that was like, girl, yeah, I got it, stuck in line. Yeah. You did? You, you, there's a certain time you don't want to go after lunch for sure. Right. And you don't want to go when kids get, I realize now, when kids get picked up from school because their yep. parents yeah. all take the kids to the voting booth. Yeah. And so my line took so long. And guys, I did the biggest mistake. I wore heels to the voting booth. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> And I was shifting, shifting. I started leaning on the brother beside me. I was like, I got I to gotta come back. So, Well, well see, I went on, on a Sunday. Mm -hmm. And the first place that I went, it was a four-hour wait. And I was Ooh. like, oh, goodness. But you know oh, what? I went on Instagram. Up. I went on Instagram because I took a picture of it. Yeah. Yeah. And I went on Instagram. And then one of my um, followers said, go to uh, this other station. It's, it's in Norwalk, the registrar's office. Okay. And so I went there. They had it all. God bless Norwalk registration yeah. Y'all yeah, yeah. had it together. Yeah. It was like an hour. That's it, all it took. Wow. It was See, an I hour. was trying to go to Culver City, and you gave yep. me the heads up on our right. group chat. Yeah. Like, was left. that the picture on your Instagram? Was yes. that from Culver City? That was that was the Culver it. City. That yeah. was um, West uh, Los Angeles. Cal and that was me to prove that I did vote. So yes. I tried. Good job, Lonnie. And I'm going to tell you guys, for those that, you know, Voting is very important. We understand it is about, you know, the general election, but that local yes. genie, I was going through it because really? for just for Los Angeles, there are a, there were 17 measures and one of the measures was the the plastic bag. That plastic bag. This is for LA. It was a plastic bag. Yes. They had um, marijuana legalizing it. You guys, it goes up to, I mean, you, it comes down yes. to the details like ticket pricing. Yes. Um, how, you, how we take care of our service people from the garbage uh, mm -hmm. uh, people for, uh, that are in our community. It, there's they a lot of the details you can take care of. Everything. That's yes. why I tell people, you guys, yes. it's not just about the, the general. Presidency. It's yeah. your yes. local yes. things yes. that are affecting yes. you. Yes. You have to make sure you check that out. Yes. I did Don't not have to see Valley when I was in New York, obviously, because I'm here now, yeah. so I had to do my early as well Smart. and you definitely have to read the whole yes. entire from top yes. to bottom because yes. it definitely makes a difference and I love Adrian that you brought in your community with this because at the end of the day like although we're all the same family when you reach out to culture it makes it feel like that same family knit like I'm gonna go vote with my mama my because I want to take her with me yeah. and you guys I learned that the Asian American community is the fastest growing community in the United States today yeah. give it up <laughs> 
good Asian businesses out there. Yeah. But most importantly, most Asian people live in what's called battleground states like Nevada and Virginia. Right. Battleground state is basically a swing state, meaning those states are most important to make that deciding vote because the candidates have equal amount of supporters for wow. both sides yeah. in those states. So that one vote could be the one that kicks America in right. the direction that you are voting for. Wow. So, no, seriously, that's awesome. it, it's so important, you guys. Throwing it out there to my Vietnamese people. Because of America. And vote. Oh, the Asian American community, for some reason, is a little bit more quiet, and they don't feel like they have as strong of a stance because mm -hmm. my people are just not super vocal. But your vote really does matter. And I was telling uncles, aunties, friends out there, we have a place in this country. Yeah. We worked hard to get here. Yeah. yeah. We worked hard to get here. So it's a giving one. Yeah. Open that present, and that is your vote. And so, I also Jeannie, want to say, you you're... black people need to get out and vote. Yes. 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 You see That's Obama's right. telling y'all about his legacy. Y'all get out there and vote, and I don't have to do it in a language. Go vote! <laughs> so many of our ancestors have paved the way yeah. and have sacrificed so much for all of us to get out there. Absolutely. And regardless of who you like, if you don't like who's there, exactly. whatever, the, the object is to get out there and take advantage of your right yes. to vote. Because so many know. people have sacrificed yes. us to get out there. And okay, we, have to, we have to get out of the mentality that we don't matter. We oh, exactly. do. Yes. Yes. And that we can make a difference yeah. as a whole. But Jeannie, I wanted to ask you something. Yes. You were getting emotional. Why were I you getting emotional? I got emotional watching her. Yeah. I, I don't know if it's from just our immigrant parents, yes. but mm -hmm. do they, do you notice that a lot of family members yes. actually say like, they don't listen to us, they don't want yeah. anything from us, they think let me matter. just go to work and come home and I'm not, I'm not a real American, even though mm. they've got their citizenship, so they don't think they count as much. I know a lot of people, I know I'm talking to you out there, you just don't think you are heard, but I'm telling you, your citizenship says you have been heard from the moment you got here. Okay. Amen.